Well, I would rather drink my milkshake than wear it, but I'm fine. I'm sorry. You look it. Forget it. Hey, look. I really am sorry. Didn't we just do this? I'm Will, by the way. Well, let me buy you another shirt. No, thanks. I'm good. Oh, I'm just practicing Southern hospitality. Oh, really? Is that what they call hanging on strangers you know now? I have no interest in buying you a shirt. Is that so? I'm just over here so the other team can catch a breath. Wow. Pushy and conceited. Why don't you come watch? I'll pass. Thank you. But I'm your kid and you taught me how to stand up and fight for myself. Oh, Roxy! Face it, Dad, it's all falling into place. Not for me it isn't. <laughs> Why not? You know I can do this. You can trust me. That's not the point. Then what is the point? The point is you're not ready to do this on your own. Yes, I am, Daddy, and you know it. Come on, Dad, let me go, please. That's it, Milo. I don't want to talk about this anymore. That's not fair. I don't have to be fair. I'm the dad, and I'm not letting you go. Why are you treating me like such a baby? Because you're acting like one. But, Dad! Miley, not another word. Fine. How about three? I hate you! Turn her back for a minute, just for one minute. Oh my god. Really? I'll do it. I swear to god, I'll do it. You don't believe me. Nobody does. So I swear to god, I'll stab myself. Dr. Karev, Alex, I need you to put that down. It'll kill me, right? If I stuck this in my heart, it'll kill me, right? If I stuck this here, I would die, right? Trust me. I can help you. I'm not crazy. I know. I, I believe you. Everyone outside thinks you're crazy, but something's going on inside, and none of us understand. So we need to figure out what that is, and the only way we can do that is if you put that down and let me run some tests. Okay? You promise? Chelsea and Brooke did. What's wrong? I, I have to leave, Carter. Leave? Leave where? Back to my country. General Kane is forcing my mother into marriage. My father's never gonna let you go back. He'll never know. Yeah, but I know, and I'm not gonna let you go back either. Carter, you have to stay out of this. I have a duty to my people. This is something you'll never understand. I've loved living here in Louisiana. And I wish my life could be like this every day. But this is not reality. Do you think my life as a princess is some kind of fairy tale? This here is a fairy tale. And I could not hide here anymore. Soon I will be queen of Ca Castellina. My country needs me. You're right. They do need you. They need you to lead them and to protect them. And that's something you can't do from jail, which is exactly where you'll end up if you go back to Castellina. 